Good day. This is Mayumi Lagrimas Katakutan. I am currently taking a Bachelor of Secondary Education at Papakadalubhasa sa Wikang Filipino in Negros Oriental State University, Main Campus 1. Today, we are going to discuss on non-cognitive traits and skills. And today, I will become your teacher. What are non-cognitive traits? Non-cognitive traits are attitudes, beliefs, greed, mindset, self-control, goal orientation, and values. These are part of a student's character and personality. This can be intrapersonal and intrapersonal. These are also called affective or social-emotional traits, which is essential for success in school and in life. Students are more successful when they are responsible, can self-monitor, and can work collaboratively. Research has established clear linkages between effect and learning. Students who value what they are doing are better problem solvers, will be more motivated to exert maximum efforts on tests, and are more likely to pay attention to information, remember it, rehearse it meaningfully, and apply it. Classrooms with positive climates foster student engagement and learning, and longitudinal studies have shown such qualities predict economic, social, psychological, and physical well-being. Why aren't such traits systematically assessed? When schooling is organized by subject, cognitive subject matter targets are the focus. Some things attitudes and values should be taught at home. Next, is defining these traits is difficult because each is abstract. Third, is the assessment of these traits is fraught with difficulty because it often depends, depends rather on student self-report. Fourth, is a teacher's frame of reference is different than her students. Due to the differences in context, backgrounds, and of course, culture, this is an example table of relationships between learning, success, and effect. For successful learning, it can be hopeful, optimistic, feels positive, wants more success, seeks challenges, seeks and uses feedback, and empowered. For unsuccessful learning, it can be hopeless, pessimistic, feels negative, wants to avoid further failure, avoids challenges, sees feedback as criticism and embarrassed. For successful learning, it can also be confident, engaged, positive attitudes, values learning, seeks new ideas, and for successful learning, it can also be unsure, disengaged, negative attitudes, avoids learning, and avoids new ideas. Those are non-cognitive traits and skills. I hope you learned something today. Goodbye!